There are some things that a person should never have to endure in life. One of them is riding a tandem bike on your own. Another is your cat making rather large meowing noises when you're trying to do a video blog. Come here, Cappy, if you want to be part of it. Another thing that you should never have to do is have to tell your neighbour that you've just run over their dog. And I'm going to count on this list. Another thing that happens to poor Cathy in episode three of The Big C, her husband filling her living room with sand in a misguided attempt to try and romance her back into his life. He is completely self-absorbed and she is finding throughout this episode, trying to find ways to cope with and deal with what's happening to her in a world where nobody really pays any attention to her. The people around her who are supposed to love her don't really see her and don't really see what she's going through. She ends up going to join a um, cancer support group, um, albeit very briefly, where she manages to pick up um, half a dozen fairly hardcore stalkers who are intent on helping her to um, come to terms with her illness, even though she doesn't want their help one little bit. I have to say, I'm really loving the music in this series, by the way. Um, the uh, opening titles goes over a track by a band that I'd never heard of, and I, I looked them up um, on iTunes just now, and um, I've downloaded one of their albums. Um, they're actually called the... Where is it? I've written that down. Uh, Leftover Cuties. They're called the Leftover Cuties, and... Um, Really, really awesome music, so um, I'm getting a lot out of this series so far.